Hey everybody and welcome back to another Wheel of Time video. Today we are doing round three of Wheel of Time not Jeopardy because clearly this is not Jeopardy and we don't have anything to do with copyrights. And we have two new contestants to face off against Angry Trevor. Both of them are winners from our Make-A-Wish contest where we ran a contest here on the channel to raise money for Make-A-Wish which by the way I am still trying to do that. Uh, I have until uh, November and I still want to raise $5,000 so you can still check out that link below uh, even though we are not running a contest uh, I it's a big thing that I want to support here on the channel I, I really do believe in giving back and I want to use this platform to help if you feel it in your heart to support uh, critically ill children please click the link below and donate anything that you can if every single one of my subscribers donated $1 we would double my goal of $5,000. We're already sitting right at about $2,000 now. Thank you to all of you. Um, and we have a couple months here to make up the rest of that $3,000, which I'm very excited to do with your help. Real quick, before getting into the video, let me first say this. I want to give a big thank you to audible.com for supporting the channel. They have been absolutely awesome in support here. If you have not checked out the audiobook versions of The Wheel of Time yet, I highly recommend doing that. You can get a free audiobook by clicking my link below or just going to www.audibletrial.com forward slash Nabeless. You can sign up for the trial. You don't have to pay a dime and you get to keep the audiobook. It's pretty awesome. And by the way, you support the channel by doing that. Lastly, let me throw up a spoiler warning. As always with these videos, this video will carry a spoiler rating of red with spoilers all the way through the end of the book. So don't watch this if you've read it and you don't want stuff spoiled. You have been warned. Oh, and by the way, I forgot before I go, make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Just by liking this, guys, and subscribing, you really help uh, support the channel. You really help YouTube share the video with everybody else. So if we want to help grow the fan base, this is a great way to do that. So if you can do that, I would appreciate it. Again, like, subscribe, uh, and share the video. So without further ado, let me give you or, or send you over to the previously recorded Wheel of Time, Not Jeopardy, Round 3. Enjoy. All right, everybody. Welcome back to episode three of Wheel of Time, Not Jeopardy. Uh, we have our three contestants here, so let's very quickly meet them. Uh, starting with our defending champion, Angry Trevor. Uh, talk some trash, Angry Trevor. I don't need to talk trash because I'm just going to win again anyways. I mean, he keeps winning. So uh, today, the challengers and the winners from our contest from Make-A-Wish uh, from the Make-A-Wish fundraiser, we uh, have a uh, famous Wheel of Time community member, Ipa. Say what's up, Ipa. Hey. All what's right. Are you, talk some trash to everybody. Let's hear you. Uh, um, I will absolutely destroy you all, and there will be nothing left of any of you, <laughs> including like the host. So. I like, okay, well, I don't like that. <laughs> uh, don't mess with me. Um, and then uh, our third contestant, Nolan. Say what's up, Nolan, and talk some. Hey, what's going on? I'm going to eat you guys like an Italian beef with Jardinera. That's just a little <laughs> Chicago. There, there you go. That's not violent. So quick explanation <laughs> of the rules if you are not familiar with um, Not Jeopardy. Uh, we, have some, uh, we have different categories here. They will get the answer to the question, and they will answer in the form of a question. You will pick up on it very quickly here. Um, we have a couple rounds here, so we will kick it off here. And since Angry Trevor is the uh, returning champion, he gets to pick first. Angry Trevor, kick us off here. Oh, oh I'm sorry. I'm supposed to run through the categories, even though you can all read them, because that's what hosts do. So let's start. Our categories to start off here are Andor, Moraine Damadred, Port Cities, The Blue Aja, Blade Masters, and Governments. Hmm. So kick us off, Angry Trevor. Well, I do like that Moraine has her own category, but let's go governments for 100, please. Governments for 100. This country's government is a matriarchal monarchy. Angry Trevor. Uh, what is Andor? Correct. You're bored. All right, let's roll on down to governments for 200, please. In this nation, there are no kings when the story begins, just an oligarchy. Nolan. What is Tyr? Correct. Well done, sir. You're bored. Uh, let's go with uh, Moraine for 100. Ooh. 
Moraine was born in this nation. Trevor. Uh, what is Kyrian? Correct, sir. All right, go ahead. <laughs> Epa's Trevor. magic. Uh, Moraine for 300, please. Moraine was of this relation to King Layman Damadred, the king who sparked the Aiel War. Angry Trevor. Uh, what is Nice? That is correct. You're bored. Uh, let's throw off the OCD, folks. Uh, let's go Blue, Blue Aja for 400, please. This is the name for the head of the Blue Aja. Angry Trevor. What is Captain General? <clears throat> Ipa. I think that... Ah, shit, I got this question wrong. What is... I don't remember. Dang it. What, what I don't remember is not the correct answer. Wish. Wish we line. <laughs> what is the <laughs> selector? Okay. Yeah. Good. I'm so glad I didn't buzz in. Trevor, <laughs> you're up. Uh, Blue Aja for 300, please. According to a new spring, a tradition of the Blue Aja is to never wear this color inside the White Tower. Ipa. What is red? Correct. You're bored. Uh, Blue Aja, 200. This blue sister first suspected Egwene of being a dreamer and tried testing her despite not really knowing what to look for. Nolan. Who is Maureen? And Ipa. Who is Anaya? Correct. You're bored. Uh, 500, Blue Aja. This is the only Aja smaller than the blue in terms of number of sisters. Ipa. Oh, this white archer. Correct. Don't worry, bud. Ah, uh, let's finish the blue archer. This Tyran was of the blue archer before being raised to the Amarlin seat. Nolan. Who is Siwan? Uh, we'll give it to you. <laughs> Swan. <laughs> There's going right. to be a lot of mis. <laughs> yeah. on well, he also yeah. wrote Suan wrong, so don't worry about it, Nolan. If you are, no, if you are new uh, to Nolan, um, he is really, Wheel of Time language is a second language for him. So, <laughs> pronunciation wise, this will be a lot of fun. So, if we have any, any Hellman's mayonnaise related questions, I'm good because the tail mayonnaise is kind of like my, uh, oh, my he's guy. Gonna, he's going to love the shout out. These are, these are people from the Discord server. So go ahead, Nolan. Uh, you're bored. Uh, let's go with Andor for 100. This is the title for the crown of Andor. Nolan. What is the rose crown? Correct. You're bored. Uh, let's go Andor 200. The eldest brother of the daughter heir of Andor carries this title. <sighs> Ipa. What is the first prince of the sword? Correct. You're bored. Uh, Moraine, 200. Moraine is attacked by a Dragar at this farm owned by these people. Ipa. Jesus. Who are Adelius and Bandine? Correct, sir. Good job. You're bored. Mm. Uh, let's continue Moraine, 400. Moraine passed Land Mandragoran's bond to this Aes Sedai when she passed oh, man. Montreal. <laughs> Ipa. Who is Morel Sedai? Correct. Your board? Uh, 500. This is the name for the blue stone that hangs from Moraine's hair on her forehead. She uses, as, uses it as a focus for her eavesdropping trick. Ipa. What is a Kessiera? Correct. Well done. Your board? Uh, Andor 300. This city sits at the center of the nation of Andor and connects its far western half with its more populous eastern half. Nolan. What is uh, Kaimon? Ipa. Uh, what is the White Bridge? Correct. You're bored. Uh, Andor 400. The city of Berylon in, the we in western Andor has many of these, which Matt made use of to build the dragons. Trevor. What are bell foundries? Correct. Your board. Uh, close out Andor for 500, please. This was the first queen of Andor. Hmm. Ah. 
Uh, Who was Ishara Castellane? Mm. Or Trevor? Uh, governments for 300, please. This country was, was ruled by two powerful rulers, a panarch and a king, that is, until they were conquered. Nolan. What is, uh, oh, crap. Terrible? Uh, no, that's not it. Uh, uh, ten, uh, not ten, 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 no, it's not Ten Chico? Nope. What? Uh, oh, I know what it is now. Nipa. What is Tarabon? Correct. Oh, I almost right. said it. <laughs> You're bored. Uh, let's count to government 400. Part of this nation's government is a council of merchants. Nolan. What is Ilian? Nope. Oh, no, that, darn it. Ipa. What is Arad Duman? Yeah. Correct. You're bored. Uh, let's finish the governments. The local government of the two rivers, specifically the mayor, is the Wheel of Time world's only example of this type of governmental structure. This is what I meant by the language barrier, by the way. <laughs> All right, we're done. What is the yeah, language barrier is killing oh, you. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, I should not a democracy. That, I, I, don't, is the yeah, uh, I, was, I was thinking that too. I was thinking All democracy. Right. But I was All like, right, you're yeah. bored again, Ipa. Uh, Port City is 400. 400? Yeah. This port city is divided into two halves, separated by the bay. Ipa. What is Ebudar? Correct. You're bored. Uh, 500 port cities. This Seafolk Island Harbor is the location that the Shan Chan regrouped after their defeat in the Haleen. Nolan. What is Tremalking? <laughs> no. Ah, man, I'm not doing well. Oh, Sean. Anybody else? All right. What is Cantorine? You're bored, Ipa. Uh, Blade Master's 400. This Blade Master is never seen wielding a heron marked blade during the story once. Ipa. Who is Lan? Correct. You're bored. Uh, 500. This is the Blade Master who Galad kills. No one. Well, who is Hemar? Hmm. No. Uh, who is Balda? Correct. Oh, geez. I'm thinking You're the bored. wrong person. You're bored. Uh, Blade Masters 300. This Kyrian and Lord Blade Master once almost defeated Rand with the sword. Ipa. Who is Taram Ryatin? Correct. You're bored. Port City is 300. The Daily Double. This port city was host to the Hylene. Hi mm -hmm. uh, this is the one where I can only answer, right? You only can answer here. Um, what is Shandar? No. What is Falma? I didn't know which side of the sea you meant. <laughs> You're bored, again. Uh, Port cities, 200. The port cities uh, to this nation are walled off to outsiders. Ipa. What is Shara? Correct. Uh, blade masters, 200. This man was a blade master from the other side of the Aerith Ocean. Ipa. Who is Hylor Turok? Well done. I'm glad you got the answers before we started when I sent these to you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for real. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Uh, Blade Masters. This man once joined the Ilioner Companions and later defeated another Blade Master before returning to his home. Trevor. Who is Tam Thor? Finally got one. You got one. <laughs> yes. Jeez. And close it out, please. This port city sits at the mouth of the River Arenen. Ipa. What is Ilion? Ah, mm. oh, fuck. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. There's no river in Ilion. Anybody else? Oh, no. I know where the area <laughs> starts at the top. What is Tia? Oh, no. There's uh, no river in Ilion. All right. We have uh, gotten to double, not, well, what, not Jeopardy now. 
Uh, let's quickly recap our scores. Angry Trevor with 600 points. Ipa has a meager 4,200 points after the first round. And Nolan is at uh, a below zero number. <laughs> <laughs> That's we'll a nice way of putting it. But anybody can make a comeback because the point totals are doubled in the second round. All right. So our categories for doubled, not what Jeopardy or what not. Well, yeah, you got it. The Sifa, Shara, The Blight, Children of the Light, Here to There, where we talk about different transportation systems in the Wheel of Time, and the world economy. So kicking us off, Ipa, you're up. Uh, Blight 1000. The Blight has swallowed this nation within the past 50 years. Trevor. What is Mulk here? Correct. You're bored. Uh, Blight 600, please. This is the title for the blight on the continent of Shanchan. Is this a trick question? Nope. What is the lesser blight? I don't uh, remember them mentioning that. That's crazy. You're bored, Trevor. Uh, blight for 800, please. These denizens of the Blight are known as Jumara in their adult form. Trevor. What are worms? Correct. Uh, blight 400, please. This creature of the, bright, of the Blight looks like the branches of a tree, but will kill someone on contact. Ipa. Well, it's a stick. Correct. Uh, let's finish off the Blight. Why not? Despite being in the north, this is the climate for the blight. Ipa. What is warm? <laughs> yep, we'll give it to you. What is arid and humid? Okay. Go ahead. Um, Children of the Light, 1000. Daily Double. This is the name of the Lord Captain Commander of the Children of the Light before Galad Damadred. Uh, who is Yemen Balda, again. Correct. Well done. Trick question, and, and you got it. You're up. Uh, Children of the Light, 800. The children were created after Lothair Mantelar wrote this book as their guide. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to remember what Galad says about it. What is the way of the light? Uh, You're bored. Well, let's go with the uh, Sea Folk 1000. This person is in charge of the defense of the Seafolk ship as well as all trade. Typically, this person is married to the sailmistress. Oh. Damn, some of these obscure ones. What is the cargo master? Your boy. Again, Eva. Okay, let's not do Seafolk anymore. Uh, <laughs> oh, no, me 800. 800? Yeah. Sea folk? Okay. Sea folk are believed to produce this commodity and they are famous for it. But it is actually produced by the Amayar, the land dwellers in the Sea folk islands. Ipa. What is silk? No. <laughs> Nolan. What is uh, sea folk pork ah, porcelain? Damn. Correct. Ah. Well done. No played. You're bored, Nolan. Uh, let's, do, uh, let's do Shara for 200. There are six towns that uh, permit overland entry into Shara, and they sit on this set of cliffs referred to by this name. Tough one. What are the Cliffs of Dawn? You're bored. Uh, let's, do, uh, let's do Shara for 400. Shara is ruled by these absolute monarchs with these oh. titles. Uh, I just watched the Shara uh, video like two weeks ago, too. <laughs> I can tell you how the end of the word is, but I can't remember the beginning of the word. Shabon and the Shabote. You're bored again. Uh, let's do, uh, let's get away from Shara, I guess. Let's do uh, here to there for 200. This is the way to get from one side of the river Tarin to the other. Trevor. What is a ferry? Correct. Uh, here to there, 400, please. 
This is the mode of travel used by Leandrin when taking Egwene to Falma. Keepa. What are the ways? Correct. Good board. Uh, let's continue with that 600. Here to there? Yeah. Okay. It is called this by channelers when they don't instantly travel to a location, but rather take a floating disc to the board. Trevor. What is skimming? Correct. Your board. Uh, here to there for 800, please. This mode of transportation gave us flicker, flicker. Owen. What is portal stones or what are portal stones? Correct. Your board. Uh, let's do uh, Shaw for 600. This is the name Demon Dread took as he led the forces of Shara into the last battle. Ipa. What is about the wild? Correct. Your board. Uh, let's finish the here to there. This is the type of prize horse that Matt purchases for two on. Ipa. What is a razor? Correct. Your board. Um, sure, turn off the light, 600. This is the formal name for the questioners. Trevor. What are the inquisitors? Mm, based off of them, but. Oh, damn it. What is the hand off the light? Yes. You're up. Uh, children, 400. This is the name for the headquarters of the children. Ipa. What is the dome of the light? Hmm. No, close. Uh, mm -mm. All right, why is it not moving? Oh, there we go. What is the fortress oh, of the right. oh. You're bored still, Ipa. Well, let's finish it off with 200. The Children of the Light are based out of this nation. Ipa. What is Amadisia? Correct. You're bored. Uh, economy 800. The best stock of horses in the world are from this nation. Nolan. What is tier? Correct. Uh, let's do world economy for 600. This nation that Padan Fane calls home relies to land trade, relies on land trade only as they have no water-based trading routes. Trevor. What is Lugard? Oh, it's technically wrong, isn't it? Damn it. <laughs> what is Murandi? Correct. Lugard mm -hmm. is the capital of Murandi, Trevor. It's a city state. Come on now. <laughs> Not a city state. You're up. Um, economy 1000. This is the world famous commodity from the two rivers. Trevor. What is tobacco? You got it right. Not tobacco. <laughs> well done. All right, you're up. Uh, world economy 400, please. Mining is the primary industry on the western part of this nation. Nolan. What is Andor? Correct. Uh, let's do world economy for 200. This country is known for controlling the oil fish, making them a target for tear. Ipa. What is my end? Correct. Uh, Shara 1000. This is the natural feature that separates the southern part of Shara from the Io Waste, basically like the Grand Canyon of Rainland. Thought you watched that Shara video, Trevor. What is the Great Rift? In my head it was saying it was just the waste. I'm like, no, it's a specific part of it. <laughs> Your boys. Let's, let's finish the Shara off. This is the name given for the channelers from Shara. Ipa. What are the Ayad? Correct. The board. Seafolk 600. The Seafolk go by this name translated from the old tongue, meaning people of the sea. Ipa. What is Atamir? Well done. Your board? Uh, 400. This is the name given for the Seafolk chosen one. Wow. Trevor. What is the Karamor? Correct. Your board, last and one, we're finishing it up. up. 
This is the title for the leader of the Sea Folk. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> what is the mistress of ships? Oh, oh. dang it. All right. So, oh. coming in to final Jeopardy, final Notwa Jeopardy, you can make your wager before seeing the uh, answer. You're going to type your answer into your um, thing. Once you've all made your wagers, it will tell me, and we can get going here. Nolan, waiting on you. Oh, my phone decided to crap out for a moment. Hold on. Here we go. All right. And here we go. This is the name that the for the war that happened right before the breaking of the world. Don't say anything. Just type it in. All right, and we have the answer. So starting with Angry Trevor. Actually, let's start with Nolan because he had our lowest point total. His answer was the War of Shadow. Unfortunately, that is not the right answer. Um, we will come back. Keepa, or I'm sorry, Trevor, your answer was what is the War of Power? And that is the correct answer. I knew that, uh, but... What is Shadow. the war of power? Also the correct answer. And our winner, I, I wonder who it'll be. Oh, Epo <laughs> won! Hey. Uh, for knocking off Angry Trevor. Hooray! You he did it. Score of 11,600 points, which is a new record uh, for What Not Jeopardy. Uh, Angry Trevor coming in a very close second place at 7,200. And Nolan got back to, to zero. So we are. I swear I know more than that. <laughs> it's hard, man. Hard. Hey, it's hard on the spot. Thank you all uh, for playing. Hopefully, you all had fun. Congratulations, Ipa. You have dethroned Angry Trevor, and you are the new defending champion of What Not Jeopardy. Uh, thank you all for joining us. I'm going to go ahead and click this off. Stick around for one sec. Tinker in the kitchen with a job of work to do Mistress up above, slipping on the rope of blue She prances down the staircase, a fancy us a free Crying, Tinker, oh dear Tinker, won't you mend a pot for me?